What's good? It's your boy KEK -E Beats, producer principles. In this video, uh, I'm gonna switch it up. You know, I did a lot of the Zaytoven videos, but in this video, I want to show you a Justice League uh, slash Drake, you know, chord progression that Aston Martin music. We're gonna start with that, man. Uh, I always loved the the piano in that song, the electric piano. So I got one loaded up, right? got an electric piano loaded up and uh, I figured out what the chords to the song was and it's actually really simple man um, we in the key a B flat minor and, you know I like this angle right here how you can see my keys but just look at the the uh, digital piano on the screen if you want to know the notes you know I'm playing B flat minor with B flat on top so I got the one on top but I'm still playing B flat in my left hand. So I got a B flat in my left hand, and then I got a B flat minor chord in my right hand with B flat on top. You know? And this is just the way it sounded closest to the song to me. And it just went from the one to the three. Let me see here. You know what I like to do is roll the chords so it'll make it sound a little fancier. And see I just added my own little rolls to it and whatnot. But use those chords, man. The the one and the three. All it really is is it's the minor chord. And then you're going to the relative major. Cause you know B flat minor and D flat major is the same keys. I could play it an octave up as well, and you can start adding more notes, doubling up all the notes if you want. And it's just that B flat minor with B flat on top. And then it's just D flat major in root position. You know, and if you don't know what none of that stuff means, man, you need to grab that uh, free piano mini course I got and Producers Piano 101. But if you already know this stuff, man, you already got the course, you definitely know this stuff is easy. But with this progression here, it's not circular movement. You know, a lot of the stuff with chord progressions, that's what you learn is circular movement and different stuff like that. You can actually go in thirds too. Shit, you can even take the thirds and, you know, you could take that and then go from the, you know. Now, I wouldn't play it like that, but I went from the four chord. Essentially, what I did was go from the one to the three to the, to the four to the five to the one. You know, just knowing different places you can go to, but really your note on top is the most important part. You know, but this song right here, real simple, two chords. You know, so don't, you know what I'm saying? It's nothing that complicated. Let's take it to C minor. Remember, we got the one on top. So with C minor, it would be, it would be like this. C minor chord with C on top you can play the C in your left hand and then you go to the three chord which is the relative major in root position E flat major over B flat you know not over E not over G not over C over B flat you know in this case, it's over B flat. Don't get it confused with the B flat minor example, you know. And that's why you need to know your scales, man. So if any of this stuff is confusing to you, make sure that you actually practicing. Watch all my videos here on YouTube. Subscribe. 
download my piano course download producers piano 101 i got 2.0 coming soon man like i'm working on that but you got to be able to understand this basic stuff before we can get to more advanced stuff you know take it back to c minor we could take it to any key really we could take it to d minor but this all just comes with knowing your keys if you say that you know your scales i know a lot of people say that they can play their scales you know a c major and you can go to f major But if you can't, if you don't know what tones come next while you're playing, if you're playing an E flat major chord and you don't know what chord can come next, you don't know what the fourth tone is instantly, then you don't really know your scales. If you don't know that it can go to, you know, A flat major, then that's going to go to D flat, G flat, B, E, all that stuff. If you don't know none of that stuff, then you're just lost in the sauce, man. So you want to actually dive deeper into this. Don't just read a post about a major scale or whatever scale, a minor scale. Don't just read the notes of, you know what I'm saying? Don't just Google B flat minor scale and see the notes and then say, I know it. You know, what chord can you play off the second tone? What chord can you play off the fifth tone? You know, do you have to play a minor chord? Different stuff like that, because you could take it... You can take it wherever you want to take it, man. These chords that I'm showing you from these songs is just showing you other songs that work so you could take those progressions and try playing with them chords yourself. So just remember the minor one chord and the major third. You know, maybe you don't want to copy them verbatim. You know, you could just do the... But you hear that one to the, uh, well, that wasn't even a one to the three. That was a one to the four, excuse me. You hear that doesn't sound the same. That starts sounding like one of them Lil Wayne Birdman songs, <laughs> like Father, Like Son. But that's why you also need to know the importance of your melody, the note that's on top. That's why that song sounds like it does. You know, so this stuff is real simple, man. I'm not, you know what I'm saying, sitting here trying to say this shit's complicated. But if you don't understand the basic shit and if you don't master the basic shit, you know, that I teach you on Producers Piano 101, then you're going to be just like the other guy who emailed me talking about, I love your videos, but I just don't understand what the hell you're talking about. That's why I put together Producers Piano 101, man. I, I say it time and time again. If you're really serious and you're not playing around, you know, then grab that course. For real, link in the description. Uh, if you already got it, man, comment. Tell me if you like this video. Uh, tell me what you want to see, man. Because, you know, I'm just telling you songs that I like. You know, that's how I did the Zaytoven. I told you stuff that I like, that I do. You know, if you want to hear some stuff for yourself, or you want to learn, you know, whatever you want to learn, man, just let me know in the comments. And shit, I'm going to make a video about it. So it's your boy K.E. K.E. Beats, Producer Principles. This was uh, Justice League, Drake, Chord Progression, Aston Martin Music. Make sure you subscribe, man. Like, comment, share, all that good shit. Tell your producer friends about the channel so they can learn too. And shit, man. You know what I'm saying? I'll see you in the next video. I'm out. Peace.